And this morning, Mayor Eric Adams is continuing to fight the city's rising crime rates. While the new anti-crime units focus on the gun violence, the mayor says another crime is running rampant. We're talking about fair beating. Fox 5's Robert Moses is live on the Upper East Side with more for us this morning. Robert. Dan, shootings and other violent crimes, of course, understandably get the lion's share of attention. But the mayor says that a minor crime like fair evasion deserves attention as well because ignoring it sends the message that anything goes. Mayor Eric Adams has just about had it with district attorneys who failed to prosecute fair beaters. If we start saying it's all right for you to jump to turn and stop, we are creating an environment. Who can stop this any and everything go? go. It's a crime. Indeed, crime has posed the biggest challenge for the mayor in his nearly three months in office. According to new NYPD statistics, through Sunday, 284 people have fallen victim to 253 shootings this year. Both numbers, shooting victims and incidents, are up by more than 17 percent. The shootings continued yesterday as captured on Citizen App. A seven-year-old girl grazed by a bullet in Coney Island yesterday afternoon. A woman shot in the face last night night in Canarsie. A man shot last night in the leg on a basketball court in Morrisania, and another man shot in the leg at the Queensbridge houses in Long Island City later in the evening. Go after those guns. That is the directive the mayor has given to neighborhood safety teams that began hitting the streets in troubled precincts last week. The new units, each made up of five uniformed officers and a sergeant, are revamped versions of the troubled anti-crime units that the city disbanded back in 2020. In the six days since the program's launch, the mayor and police commissioner say the teams have made 31 arrests and removed 10 guns from the streets. 61% of those arrested had been previously arrested, most for a major felony. 39% have a history of narcotics-related arrests. 26% have a link, a link to gang or crews. And 23% or more are on parole or probation. The mayor hailed the first week as a success, but he cautioned reducing crime takes time. Crime is a Titanic. <laughs> you know, crime is an ocean liner. And turning around, that ocean liner will not be easy. According to those statistics the NYPD released yesterday, every category of major crime this year is up, with the lone exception of murders. There have been two fewer murders this year compared to last. Reagan, back to you. All right, Robert, thank you so much.